You know, over time, I have realized that music is a powerful art form. And that art, overall, I've been to a lot of museums. And to me, art itself, as in like, oh yeah, some paintings, um, well actually most paintings, some sculptures and modern art entirely pretty much, don't really make you feel the way that music does. Like, don't get me wrong. Like I said, some paintings will make me feel like, oh yeah, that's horrible. Like, in like a way where it's like... What the artist is trying to depict is realistic, and it's supposed to be like, oh yeah, that's a horrible thing that's happening. happening. Or, that's a good thing that's happening. A lot of paintings and a lot of art does not make me feel that way. But music makes me feel so much differently. Music is the best art form in the entire art industry. In my okay, like that may sound like a hot take to some artists, but there is nothing that really just makes you get all like sad and emotional or happy and prideful like music does. No, art doesn't make you dance around and about. Music does that. Listening to Kendrick Lamar's song, Pride, has really taught me a lot about music and the reason why I made this video. Because whenever I listen to that song, I'm like all sad. I get all sad and I'm like thinking about the negatives, the downsides. And it's like, it's the beat it's the way he's talking, it's the voice changing from the highs to the lows. Like all that jazz, all of that. Speaking of jazz, jazz makes me feel like I want to snap and then dance around in an up BB. R&B kind of makes you feel a little bit of smooth, but also a little bit of a dancing feeling. Hip hop makes you want to bust around and about. I don't know. It makes you also bump your head like this. Same thing with jazz. Rap makes you feel different. It makes you feel like a gangster, I guess. I don't know. Classical, it makes me feel all British, and then I talk like this, and I get in a classical meeting of the Ruckin' Talks, or whatever classical things are we thinking about, and it makes you feel formal. Music just makes you feel better than so much other art forms. And, the, and it doesn't matter if it's good. It doesn't matter if it's perfect. It doesn't matter if it's really bad. And it doesn't matter if it's just okay. It still makes you feel a better way than a normal painting ever could. Let me say that right now. Like, a painting cannot be compared to Kanye West, to me. To, like graduation if you put up a painting and then you put up like a kendrick album or a song or a kanye album or a kanye song and depending on whatever it is if it's bound to then i'm gonna feel different than whatever painting it is okay i'm sorry but i'm there's no hate against artists and painters i love i love the art that you guys make in some cases I think, oh yeah, that looks nice, that looks cool. Sometimes, most of the time, pretty much. I don't rep know the meaning. And with songs, it's also like that too. But you can kind of tell the meaning if you listen to the lyrics. You sort of figure it out. You Google it, or you kind of get the tone as you are listening to it. You can't get that in a painting. I just want to say that right now. Because, to me, it's just... Music is a key. It's essential to our lives. Every single person loves music. Heck, my channel does so good off of music itself. The videos I make about music do good, and I'm happy about that. And I want to do and I want to keep on talking about stuff that is not just related to music and other stuff and music itself. Literally, music is essential to life as it is to me it is the greatest art form we have thank you guys so much for watching
like and subscribe for more content. I thank you guys so much for the support and all the stuff. Um, I'm sorry for what, like, for not making as much content. I'm trying to, but a cut things keep on coming up, and I'm also trying to come up with ideas. But yeah, thank you guys so much. Bye.